Ooh, hello, buddy. This is Jabik here, and welcome to my all new comic call number 27. That is right, I'm back with another comic call, and this one is a very exciting one for me. I actually kept my promise, and today, this is my all X Men comic call. That's right. I got 11 comics today, and every single one of them are X-Men related. So yeah, this is something I don't usually do, focus on one a group of characters or one um, group and in general for comics. Like, sure, sometimes I'll get quite a few Spider-Man books in one haul, but usually I don't know if I've ever done like a legitimate haul besides maybe some early ones. That was just focused on one character or group of characters. Um, so this is really interesting um, for me. Um, I actually bought all the comics but one in there. Um, all X-Men Gold issue number 6 is still in my pull list. Because X-Men Blue comes out this week. Um, and I buy one when I buy the other. So I didn't want to buy X-Men Gold number 6 without X-Men Blue number 6. Or else I, if both of them were out I might have just bought them both and caught up. Um, actually, this came to a pretty decent price, a more decent price than I thought I was going to, so that was cool. I was only going to get, like, nine books, and then I ended up getting ten, and then I just ended up getting eleven, so it just kind of kept adding up, but, you know, whatever. Uh, I think it's eleven, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, it is eleven. Okay, um, so yeah, all of these, I actually only have, um... I'll only have nine to actually read though, because two of the two of the comics in here are variants. So yeah, um, and I'm gonna get right into this haul now. So the first comic that I picked up today, I just got these today, by the way. Um, I got some good old moolah, good old pay, and um, then I bought comics. Um, so yeah, it's been a pretty good day so far. I'm almost done all the books that I had in my reading bag from last week's that comic show and I'm almost done my last comic call. And I still gotta do a ranked for two comic calls ago. Uh number twenty five. So yeah. Um but yeah, we're gonna get I already said this, but we're gonna get into it with the first book today. Um, X-Men Prime, issue number one, slash one shot. Um, yes, I finally got this book. It came out in March. It's been sitting in my pull list for months. I didn't put it in right away, but it's been it's still been sitting in my pull list for a couple months now. Um, because I did put it in, like, after a month after it came out. Um, so, yeah, um, wow, I'm really excited to get this. It was an extra dollar than most books are, five ninety nine. It was actually the only five ninety nine book I got this week, I'm pretty sure. So I was like, you know what? I'll offer one more expensive book and it's been sitting there for months and it's X Men related. So I was like, this was actually the last book I picked out and I was like, you know what, let's get it. Um by the way, these are in the order I'm gonna read them. I just wanted to say that. But, but yeah. I'm pretty excited to read this one. It looks interesting. I mean it kinda kicks off the whole res resurrection stuff or like it helps it drives into it. It's on the, it's a one shot. Um I can pick it up. I'm happy with it. So yeah, really excited um to read this one and I'm hoping it's a good good little one shot, one good little story. So yeah. Um then next um I picked up finally cable issue number one. Actually cable number two if if I remember correctly comes out this week. So it's kinda of perfect timing. Um so yeah, I might add cable to my pull list. I don't know yet. I kind of like to read this first issue before I decide that, but I think I'll put issue two in my pull list. Um, I actually have a big week of comics this weekend. If I am adding cable, and also it's going to be whew, quite the week for comics. But yeah, I think I'm going to um, put number two in my pull list and just say I'm getting cable. But we'll see. I haven't added it to my pull list officially yet. Same with the next book. But um, I, I don't know if I told you guys this. But there is one of these books that I just added to my pull list, so we'll get to that in a little bit. But yeah, Cable Number One. There was also a variant there um, at my shop that I think is still there that nobody's taken. That's just been on the shelves. But I, I decided to get the regular cover. I did, I, and I didn't even put the variant in my bag. Um, it's not that great of a variant cover, but I might get it if I can afford to spend a little extra one time. Um, and if I enjoy this issue, and maybe if I put in my pull list. But I just wanted to give this a try. When they first announced the Resurrection stuff, this was the series I kind of wanted to get the most. So uh, it, that's kind of changed now. But 
I still want to give it a try and we'll see what happens. So yeah, hopefully it's a good read. Um, yeah, it looks pretty decent inside, so that's nice. Um, but yeah, now we're going to move on to another number one. There's a lot of number ones in here. Um, three in a row, add four in a row with X and Plus. Here with X Men Prime, but the next one is Jean Grey issue number one. Actually, kind of the series I've been most, uh, I was most interested in the past couple months. Um, but this is not the series that is in my pull list. And actually, my shop, I don't, I don't think got any copies of issue number two, which has been out for a couple weeks or so now, a few weeks. Uh, but uh, if or if they did, they didn't get many copies. So, yeah, I might have to tell if I enjoy this issue and want to add it to my polls. I'm going to have to ask my shop owner to see if he can get um, more or any copies of Gene Grade M2. And I might tell him about that um, later on this week. So, we'll see. Um, I think I might anyway, just because I think that the, at least the first like store I ever show you should get quite a few copies of. So, yeah, Gene Grade issue number one. Really excited to read this one. This one has looked really good to me for months now. So, yeah, and I'm a huge fan of all new X Men and X-Men Blue, so, and she's like the main character in those books, or she's one of the main, obviously, so, I'm really excited, I think this will be a really good read, and yeah, it looks good also on the inside, all these books look pretty good on the inside, X-Men Prime probably looks the worst, and now moving on yet again, I love the layout of all the covers, by the way, with the characters in the corner, like the X and stuff, I love it, um, but yeah, the next book is actually... I actually picked up the first two issues of it because this is the new series, the newest series. I also I also added Luke Cage to my pull list. Um, I added to it. I added to last week. I added Luke Cage and I added this series to my pull list, and that is Iceman issues number one and two. Now I didn't hear the best review about this one from somebody, but uh, I don't know. We'll see. I th I have a feeling I'm gonna like this one. This one to me looks really good. Um, this might be an underrated read. Um, I'm gonna pick it up. And I'm actually happy with my choice also because I saw some of the covers, special covers they're doing for Legacy. And Nice Man's getting one, so I'm going to try to pick that up. But yeah, really excited. Um, Can't wait to read this one. Um, possibly the most out of all these um, because it's a new series and it's one I had to my pull list. Actually, my shop owner has only ordered one copy of each issue so far, of issues one and two. And that was before anybody put them on their pull list. So now I have it on my pull list. So... It just so happened that I was like, oh, I want to give it a try. I want to give Iceman a try. So I've been taking the solo copy that has come to the shop with these first two issues. And it'll probably be like that for the next two issues too because there's like two months in head order or whatever. Or at least the next one, it will be probably like that. Hopefully he's ordered in a copy for the next um, two issues and he'll remember to order because that would be lovely. Because I would hate to start picking this up and then not be able to pick it up because the issues don't come in like that's happened to me with a lot of stuff so yeah Iceman issues number one and two really excited to read this can't wait I love the covers and I love the art inside so we'll see um now I'm moving on I got a few issues of X-Men Gold here to show off um I got X-Men Gold issue number four and it seems like Gambit's gonna be in this issue which is really cool don't know if he's gonna stay on the team or gonna be on the team but I uh, hide away pretty cool Neat to see Gambit. Then I also got X-Men Gold issue number 5. I'm getting really caught up with X-Men Gold and Blue. And I'm caught up now with Iceman. Um, X-Men Gold number 5. And I also got, moving on now to a variant. One of the two variants. Um, I got the X-Men Gold number 5 Mary Jane variant. Yes, that is right. I actually wasn't even supposed to get a copy of this. But he had an extra, so I ended up with it. So it was really awesome. Really excited um, that I could get this Mary Jane variant. Um, so yeah, that was really nice. Um, I, I like the cover. I mean, I like the regular covers better, kind of. But yeah, still like this. Um, now moving on. I also, of course, if I get X-Men Gold, I'm going to get X-Men Blue. And the same amount of issues. So I got X-Men Blue, issue number four. X-Men Blue, issue number five. Like I, These are, with Iceman, these are probably the two... I'm more, most excited to read too. Um, and then X-Men Blue number 5. Also the Mary Jane variant. Also Jimmy Hudson. Um, Ultimate Wolverine son. But yeah. He was the Wolverine. Um, 
of course, teased. Um, but yeah, Mary Jane, variant for X-Men Blue, number five also. And I think this one I actually like more than the last one, even though technically the art is kind of better on the last one. But I also wasn't supposed to get a copy of this, but it just so happened he had an extra one also of this. So I just got really lucky. I was like, oh, when I saw there was a Mary Jane variant for X-Men Blue too, I figured there would be, but at the same time, I wasn't sure. I mean, I already had the one for gold. I was like, oh, I really hope that he has one that I can have because I really didn't want to have one of it the other than that that would have sucked but it worked out perfectly it worked out almost too perfectly it's been working out pretty perfectly altogether for the X-Men books for me besides maybe not having a Jean Grey number two if I wanted um but yeah I mean it's been working out pretty good and I'm excited and I cannot wait to read every single one of these comics and anyway guys this has been my X-Men haul I'm really excited um I had a lot of fun um I've had a l i have had I've had a good day. I'm really excited to read these. Um looking forward to reading these. Um I might do more themed hauls um more often, but the next haul won't be. I'm just gonna be picking up random books probably for the next few hauls. Um so don't expect this again anytime soon. Maybe you'll get it again once within uh within the next couple months. Maybe I'll do a Defenders themed haul, which might happen because uh, Defenders number two comes out and number one I don't have and I'm picking up Jessica Jones and Luke Cage so that could happen where it's sort of a Defenders themed uh, so I'm picking up half of the Defenders team's books plus the the, yeah, the actual team book so yeah we'll see but yeah anyway guys I think I'm going to end the video now so we'll just show off the, the books again um, so yeah, um, anyway guys, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, subscribe, comment, even share what you'd like to, and anyway guys, I'll see you on the next video, whatever that shall be, um, hopefully I'll get to record an episode, of, that episode of Ranked I still have to record, maybe even later today, probably not though, or tomorrow, um, but I won't be able to record Wednesday, probably, maybe I will, we'll see, uh, but I will be, of course, recording Thursday, that comic show as long as everything goes right and my phone doesn't break or anything, so yeah, but anyway guys, like I already said, I'll see you on the next video. To me, my X-Men, and peace out.